Hey traders, it's Joe here, and I'm going to do a quick closing read. So yesterday was a doozy. We were bullish, and tension started out positive up here. It came down, it crossed zero, but price continued higher, and a couple of news bombs put tension back above zero, so we ended up closing again above zero for the fourth day in a row. Now, let's see on a micro level, and this is how I really like to read the markets, because this gave us a lot of clues. So we have this red line, which is McClellan Velocity, and you can see that in the morning, the bulls did not buy the retest of zero, but they bought the retest of minus 20 once, the retest of minus 20 twice, and the retest of minus 20 three times. Now, the bears, on the other hand, had an opportunity to short the idea of velocity going above zero. They did not, and they had another opportunity to short the idea of it going above plus 20. They did not. And then the bulls had a chance to buy it when it went below plus 20, and they bought it. So that's about four times the bulls are pretty active on a micro level, even though on a macro level they didn't really do a whole lot to affect tension. Now, I am of the paradigm that you keep trading with the winning team until they tell you otherwise. And right now, I do not see the bears active in the market. I still see the bulls buying bearish ideas, bearish setups, or even more simply, they're buying the dip. So that's what I'm going to do today. However, I will keep in the back of my mind that the bulls have tension really close to zero. And unlike these past couple of days where the risk of tension going to zero or crossing zero is pretty low, it's pretty high that bears could potentially get tension below zero. They could start getting motivated, especially with price being much higher. But until they do that, until it happens, I'm not going to trade with them because they're just losers and I like trading with winners. I just do. And I don't really care who's winning, the bulls or the bears, just trade with the winning team. It's pretty simple. So you can see structurally that, and on a micro level, the bulls have been winning. So I'm going to trade with the bulls. So, all right, everybody, have a good day. I am leaving later on today. Um, I'm going to Utah again with my lady friend. Uh, I won't be back until Wednesday. So I will see everybody Wednesday. Good luck trading today. We've had a great week today. And uh, let's hopefully get one more good trading day in. All right. Take it easy, folks. Have a good weekend. See you in the room.